I am Anil Kumar and now we will further explore this topic factorials and permutations with a very interesting example and different conditions. How many ways can you pick a president, vice president and secretary from a group of six boys and five girls? So, so we have three positions to fill. We have three positions to fill out of six boys and five girls and then we have different conditions the first condition here is there are no restrictions at all well if there are no restrictions at all then we know that six plus five means we have 11 candidates right no restrictions to fill three that means the answer is 11 P3 correct so that becomes your answer the second condition is there must be at least one boy chosen now when we say at least one boy chosen we can have the answer as uh, no restriction take away when we say at least so the key word here is at least one boy right so it could be one boy two boys or all three boys do you see that so the best way will be no restrictions take away no boys then that really means one boy has been chosen do you see that so so that really means no boys so total we know is 11 p3 right so total we know is 11 p3 take away no boys that means all girls that means all girls so that really means there are five girls we are choosing three out of five so five p3 do you see that so that becomes your answer for condition b you would always use calculator calculate these answers part c is there must be only one girl now this is very interesting only one girl so let's look into the scenario once again we are having these three positions and we want only one girl so the key word is only one girl now one girl is taken from five girls there are five girls so if I take one girl, then it is one from five. So five P one means one girl. Is it okay? Since there are two other positions to be filled, these two could be filled only by boys. And how many boys are there? Six boys. We have six boys. So these two will be filled by six boys. So we have six P two, right? And their product will give me combination if I choose one girl for let us say president right but we have three different posts so the girl could be president could be vice president or could be secretary that means I should multiply this by three you get an idea so the answer for the part C will be three times 5 P 1 times 6 P 2 correct so that is how you can actually solve and get your answers. So I hope the concept is clear. This video is more to learn about understanding how to solve such questions rather than calculating values. You can always use your calculator to find the answer. Feel free to share the comments and your views about my solution. Thank you and all the best.